Today, I'm looking to talk about something that's a car and a gadget. That is this car right here, the Tesla Model Y. Okay, here we are in the vehicle and I just wanna get straight into some of the first impression stuff. The first thing I immediately noticed when I started driving was the regenerative braking. Not to make it sound like it's a huge deal or anything like that, I just really wasn't expecting it once I got out onto the roadway. The amount of braking that it applies is fairly strong and is enough to have you be able to slow down quick enough when you're at like a what I would call a safe following distance which is like two to three cars away. If you are somebody that drives really close to somebody else you may not have enough time to slow down. Moving into the rear view of the window it's a lot smaller than I expected. My usual car is a fairly small car and I would dare to say that the back window view from like the rear view mirror is almost the same and given that this vehicle is a decent bit larger I just thought it was kind of crazy I'm not really sure what I was expecting because it seems like as time goes on the back windows for cars are getting smaller in order to account for that kind of tapering body style for like the back of a car or something like that which makes sense as the window angle decreases like instead of having the window like this where you have the most amount of viewing room and it starts to go like this you slowly start to lose that like field of view in the back and I think that's kind of what I'm noticing I have always just kind of wondered like what all of the materials feel like in the car and I'd say for the most part it's like pretty soft overall the handle on the side over here which has kind of like a leather on the front and then like a soft plastic on the back there's this area on the side which on the white interior kind of just feels like a faux leather type of material then there's these kind of like harder plastics on the outside which i would say feels about standard maybe like a little squishier then there's the seats the seats are definitely squishy Kind of like a marshmallow especially in the white interior but this slowly starts to fade as you make your way up the seat for some reason which especially comes in when it comes to the headrest and i don't know if this is like a nitpick or like maybe i'm just not using it right but the headrests are kind of hard like i won't i won't lie like this kind of is like i don't know it just feels like it's not it's not as squishy as i thought it would be especially when the rest of the seat is so so soft and like plush one thing that i thought was cool from like pictures and stuff were these visors they kind of have like a curved look to them and they have a magnetic clasp which is also pretty cool but then there's the thing that exposes the vanity mirror on most cars it's kind of like a slider but on this one it's the fold cover thing which which is cool it feels nice because there's magnets and stuff The steering wheel, something that's going away on other Tesla models. 